friends. My name is Amanda, and I'm the founder of Sama Dog, well-being for dogs and their humans. Today, we're going to cook a kapha balancing meal for your dog. So what's that all about? It's all about Ayurveda. Ayurveda is a body of knowledge, a holistic science from the East that guides us to live our lives in harmony with nature and to live our lives through all aspects of our being, body, mind, and spirit. So that's really what we'll bring into uh, the conversation around food when it comes to our dog. This meal will be kapha balancing, as I mentioned, and kapha is one of the doshas. Dosha is a word for the mind-body principles or constitutions that make up Ayurveda. Kapha dosha is created by two elements, earth and water. So when earth and water come together, they create kapha. And what is kapha is that heaviness. It can be a little slow. It's very stable. It's grounded, not too quick to move. When out of balance, for in our dog's case, it can get lethargic, um, withdrawn, weight gain, slow digestion, and um, just a, a lack of lust for life. So you'll see that a meal like this that's very light and healthy for Kapha dogs to help them lighten their body and mind um, will really pay off. And you'll notice a big difference in your dogs. So let's get started. So here we have a foundation of um, grain-free kibble. So you can start with any high quality kibble if you'd like. Then we just add in, I'm a big proponent of adding in fruits and vegetables to dog food. So we have here some red cabbage, some green beans, some Brussels sprouts, and some celery. Celery especially, so good for the fiber um, that it delivers to dogs. But of course, all these vegetables, great for dogs and great for kapha because they're light and invigorating in their nature these vegetables. These have been cooked in a little bit of a sesame oil, also another light oil, great for kapha dosha balancing. We will add in a little bit of digestive enzymes. So this is uh, called solid gold, and it uh, contains seaweed, flaxseed, and digestive enzymes. So this will help with the kapha um, digestion that sometimes is quite sluggish and um, a little bit hard to get going. So that will help a lot. And we'll add in a bit of meat. This is some turkey, just some ground turkey with veggies. This is for dogs, so it has bones in there. You can get this at your local pet store, all kinds of nutrients in there. We add in some turmeric. So this turmeric is the same uh, kind of turmeric you would take for yourself. Turmeric is a great anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial. Um, it will, uh, especially with kapha, because sometimes they do tend to be a little inflamed with all that earth and water. So just be sure, to, anytime you're using turmeric, to have a little bit of black pepper in there as well, because that will help with the absorption. So what I'll do for a 30-pound dog is add about a half of a capsule of turmeric. And then adding in some apple cider vinegar. So this is just you know any organic apple cider vinegar. Usually fill about a half of a lid. Uh, depending on the size of your dog, of course, again, we're cooking here for a 30-pound dog, so I did about three-quarters of a lid full. That's great to cut through that kapha. You know, it really helps balance out any yeast or kind of stagnation in the body. And then last but not least, the Honest Kitchen. So this is just a little bit of Honest Kitchen. Honest Kitchen is a great uh, formulation of a dehydrated food that is reconstituted with a little bit of warm water. So this is a much easier way to add the nutrients, the phytonutrients, into your dog's meal if you're not necessarily into cooking. I've added a lot of things in here. You can choose just a couple. Please don't think that you have to go hog wild with all these ingredients with your dog now. You can just add in a few, and they will benefit from it greatly. So we'll add some of the mix. Stir that together. And here we have a kapha balancing, light and invigorating meal. I realized I forgot one thing, a little cinnamon. Cinnamon spices in general are great for kapha, just as they are for kapha humans, because it gets the body moving. It gets the mind light, and it gets the digestion rocking. So just a little bit of cinnamon in there. Dogs typically really like the taste of cinnamon as well. So now we've got this all mixed together for an invigorating, light, healthy meal for your kapha dog. Enjoy.